it's time to watch Silent Night, Deadly Night Part 3. Better watch out. And um, I'll have to show two posters here because it's really goofy. There's one where you can see like the main character, like the girl from the film, I think. And there's one that's like empty. Like, look at that shit, man. That shit looks so bland. <laughs> Anyways, I'm joined by David Bergantino. Hello, everyone. It's good to have you back. It's been a while. Good to be back. Awesome. This is my Christmas present. <laughs> well, what, what's your uh, what's your history with this film then? <laughs> I have I have not seen this. Awesome. So this will be the first time I'm watching a movie with you that I probably haven't seen 300 million times. Yeah. <laughs> so this will be this will all be fresh, fresh blood. All right, are you ready to start the film? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking goofy <laughs> title uh, card. Bill Mosley was like in, he was also in the blob for like two seconds. Oh, really? I didn't know that. He, he plays like one of the, um, like what should you call it? Like one of the scientists, you oh, know, really? like in the crazy suits yeah, and oh, shit. Right, and right, right. He's one of those and he gets killed within two seconds. <laughs> uh, I just saw that Eric DeRay, who's in Twin Peaks, is in this. Interesting. Wow, Robert Culp? There's some actual real people in this. <laughs> what if she had to hold her breath so that we could think she's dead for a while? <laughs> she's like, <gasps> yeah, <laughs> she's pretty. I, w I was going to say that's actually true. She's very pretty. I like her hair. Uh, and I was going to mention her hair. Yep. too. <laughs> she doesn't scream believably, however. Run, rabbit, run. <laughs> <laughs> What? Santa, you've got to help. <laughs> Yo ho ho whore. Oh no, that's that's Freddy as Santa. <laughs> yes. Some really weird imagery so far. And bicycle. And roller Is she skate. twelve all of a sudden? And ballation. Or six. <laughs> Anything for you, Dr. Newberry. I don't think I want to do this anymore. That makes me think of the line in uh, Dexter season three when uh, Dexter tells Miguel Prada, like, um, I, I can't do it. I can't kill with you, <laughs> you know? And then Miguel Prada is like, well, now fuck you. <laughs> you <know? laughs> She's like, I don't think I can do this anymore. Well, then fuck you. And then she'll let me go as deep as I want. Mm. She likes it, loves it. She can't resist it. She wants to penetrate his mind. We're, we're, we're talking about mind stuff now, me. right? Oh. He said garbage day is over. <laughs> right. Do you believe her to actually be blind? Yeah. Could you let me know what he's doing? Not for a moment. Oh. <laughs> okay. Good Laura. <laughs> She's like to help smiling. <laughs> he's in he's in Twin Peaks too. <laughs> it looks like his brain is actually larger than what his head would yeah, be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say that too. <laughs> no, no! <laughs> <laughs> of course. We had to get a bad no scream in this movie. <laughs> Supat! It's the next big thing! <laughs> Buy it now on Amazon Prime. <laughs> Get your Amazon soup hat in time for Christmas. <laughs> Buy six. One for everyone in your family. <laughs> Nothing good is going to come from that baster. No, I know, right? <laughs> Especially since it's it's a metal one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nobody knows how notices how weird he is. Maybe it was Ricky screaming. <laughs> he tasted her cooking and it's yeah. terrible. <laughs> Isn't that weird? Like dinner's about to be served and she's drawing a bath. I mean, that's I mean, I know I know the, the old folk like when you when the kids wash up before dinner, but come on. This is a little uh step further. <laughs> yeah. Do you know 
what they call it when you get deja vu twice? A reoccurring extrasensory phenomenon. Uh, stupid. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> the, o- the only funny thing about that is you trying to figure out what the punchline is. <laughs> I couldn't figure out the punchline. <laughs> Have they opened the oven yet? Hmm? Oh, yeah. Grandma's probably there. <laughs> mm-hmm. That was a very half-hearted run to a door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Does she have a, an accent? I don't know what's going on here, but whatever it is... She does have an accent. I was just going to say, but that shit kind of scared the shit out of me. Uh-huh. <laughs> I mean, jump. <laughs> <laughs> you won't be well, stay there by the door i know right like moving to the middle of the fucking room yeah, they, they seem not as concerned about what just happened they're being like yeah well you know we should you know, it's just that. <laughs> i know. You know it's a thing with the thing <laughs> and why does ricky not just walk through the door he like made a huge hole he could have easily fucking kicked mm-hmm. a little at the bottom and walked through it Hello, Ricky. It's Dr. Newbear. Evil dice tonight. Evil <laughs> dice tonight. <laughs> oh, God, please. <laughs> you have power. Ah. <laughs> oh. No, Granny did not die the way I thought she was going to. I was expecting uh, chopped up pieces or something, at least. I was expecting the baster to be sticking out of her forehead. Yeah. So basically, it's just part two, less Christmas, <laughs> less action, and more brain soup. <laughs> more brain soup. Because, like, what did we get from this movie? <laughs> I, I don't know. And she wasn't, like, spectacularly psychic. Yeah. And and all that business with, with Yoda Granny, use your power only... She didn't do anything. <laughs> right? <laughs> I don't know how you did it. I guess there's a lot of things that I don't know. She stabbed him with a stick. That, that's pretty straightforward. Yeah. You don't need to be a psychic for that. And considering he was just hit, he was just shot with a shotgun at point blank range, got back up, <laughs> him simply laying on a stake and being dead is really anticlimactic. I, I feel like that's the best way to describe this movie. Yeah. Anticlimactic. Uh huh. I agree. And a happy. New year. Yikes. Huh. Yeah. You, you got to give him credit. It was pretty silent and it was pretty deadly. <laughs> it's genius. <laughs> yeah. It's it's like the Hellraiser films. There you go through eternal suffering when you watch that franchise. <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly. It's so poetic. <laughs> yeah, watching them will tear your soul apart. <laughs> well, gee, we just, <laughs> we just watched Silent Night, Dead of the Night 3. <laughs> Of all the things the doc, if the doctor's trying to do this thing to treat coma patients, Mm -hmm. why choose a murderer whose brain has been blown up? And then (laughs) it's just kind of, that's the foundation of the whole thing. And that's not a good foundation. Like what I will say though, is that, um, look, maybe it's because I was born in 2003, you know, but like (laughs) the overall, just the way the camera looks, the aspect ratio, and just this 90s well late 80s early 90s uh aesthetic mm-hmm. that that kind of remind me of like uh it kind of reminds me of a early uh an early 90s stephen king straight to tv movie you know yeah. in terms of aesthetic and vibe yep. you know 
I'm glad that I watched it for the first time here and now with yes, you. Me too. I think otherwise I would have been like, oh God, I have to go through this for yeah. the next hour and a half. <laughs> Some of the effects were great too, like surprisingly great, quite honestly. It was it was it was sort of cookie cutter, but not even like good cookies. So um well is there anything you would like to add? No, I other than uh this this is the highlight of my season and I'm really glad that we're still doing this. And Hell yeah. we're gonna be doing it next year. And if I may, I just wanna wish everybody out there a Ah. <laughs> sure. Let's try this again. Just uh, wish everybody a happy holiday season. Yeah, for me too. Thanks everybody for sticking with my bullshit <laughs> for another year. <laughs> or if you're sticking around for just this video, thank you for watching. And uh, I hope you stick around for more. Yeah, Merry Christmas, everybody. We'll see you guys uh, some other time. See All ya. Right. Bye.